market looks so beautiful it's a very beautiful weather today we have 18 kids from uganda have you ever heard of uganda before is there anybody who's been been to uganda before okay you've eaten some ugandan fish okay good so today we're going to see ugandan dancing from 18 kids they're passionate uh, they know the moves far better than me I'm hoping that at the end of the day they will teach you some of the moves. Maybe we can have a few volunteers who will join them later. I don't know. Should we hope for that? Yes. Okay. And um, that's what's going to happen uh, for a couple of minutes. However, I would love to invite you because we're just going to do what we're doing here is like a promotion. We have like concerts like up to uh, Sunday night. So today we are at a church called Hobart Baptist Church in the northern part of Hobart. And that's where we're going to be today, starting at 7 p.m. Uh, tomorrow, we have the C3, C3 Church, starting at 10 a.m. Then in the afternoon, at around 1.30, we're going to Sorrel at an Anglican church up there. You can come and see what's happening, and you can come and watch the full concert. So we're just going to give you just a tip of it, just a little bit of it. But the full concert, you can catch us today at the Hobart Baptist Church, 7 p.m. Or tomorrow, at the C3 Church, 10 a.m. Or so real at 1 30 you can just come and be a part and see what the kids are doing uh, some of our helpers have flyers uh, some of the people who are putting on these t-shirts as well as some of our volunteers who are working with us here who have hosted us very well here have flyers they're going to hand out to you just read through it get to know more about the choir we have been in australia for three months we have five more months to go we are all around we've been all over south australia we've been to melbourne and we've crossed on a very big rocking boat to come here. So the kids are really expecting uh, you to enjoy them. So even when you don't know what they're singing, just smile. They will enjoy that. Is that all right? So wherever you are around this market, stop for a moment. Come to this corner and watch Ugandan dancing. You will enjoy it. So can we have the kids? Come on. Kids, come on stage. Kids, they're waiting for you. Right, so this is the Mwangaza Children's Choir. Mwangaza is a word in Swahili and East African language that means shining light. And we believe that our children are a shining light for the whole world to see. All right, so welcome to Mwangaza Children's Choir. Kids between the age of 9 to 14. The youngest being 9, the eldest being 14. Children of the light, we are the children of the light. 
come from a very beautiful country called Uganda where there are many beautiful lakes and green sceneries sweet mango fruits mm. mouth water and watermelons wow and pineapples yes you should plan to come by and visit us soon have you heard have you heard hello hey hey downtown you are over talking and yet you will know that we are here to bless these great people and their little ones like us with great african music okay okay but don't forget to come and visit us in uganda in east africa for now downtown please enjoy our next song in africa
we are going to preach God's word through singing and dancing. And we are not scared by anything because God loves us and he set us free from fear. So we are not supposed to be scared because God loves us and he is there to protect us. Why don't you rise up and dance to the Lord? song so please don't go did you get yourself a flyer like this one so please guys who are distributing any of the flyers please distribute this one or the other yellow one so that people can get to know this choir is called the Mwangaza children's choir it's from uganda east africa from a place called gaba in kampala and we are having concerts in your country uh, in your state of tasmania and we we'll love you to attend tonight we are the hobart baptist church come and see us at 7 p.m Tomorrow we are at the C3 Church. 
Come and see us at 10 a.m. And the day after, uh, tomorrow afternoon, we are at the Sorel. It's called St. Judges Square. You can find that here. Come and see us at 1.30 p.m. Only just three concerts here. And after that, we're going back to the mainland. You need to come and watch this choir. We have costumes, lights, screens, everything else. So this is just a taste of what's going to happen. We have been in your country three months, two and a half, almost three months. And we're here for five more months. We have even eaten kangaroo sausages. That's how much we like your country. Yes. So we love your country. But listen, we want to just share the message with you. These kids have a cause and they have the message. And what the message is as simple as this. People of Australia, God loves you. I know that sounds crazy, but that's it. I saw up there, Dio El Mondro, my God and my right. God loves the people of Australia. Great nation, and God loves you. Second thing I would like you to know is these kids are trying to speak on behalf of other children in Uganda. And they're trying to speak. That's why we're doing this tour, so that other people in Uganda, children like their age, can go to school. So they are off school for almost eight months to raise funds for their friends back home so that we can build an ultra-modern secondary school for kids like them and their friends to go to school. So, before we finish this concert, if you love their music and you want to donate to their cause, there's a bucket here. You can drop in anything you feel like. And that will be fine. So, at the end of this, you can drop that in the bucket. Is that alright? Yeah, it's up to you. It's okay and it's fine. But come to the concert. Come and hear more of this music. We have 10 songs. The concert is one hour. So you come to Hobart Baptist Church today on the northern side at exactly 7. Or tomorrow at C3 at 10, the Mwangaza Children's Choir will be live in performance. We love your country. Tasmania is beautiful. We love meeting you people. After this, the kids will be here if you want to talk to them. We'll be here if you want to know more about this. But thank you so much. One more song from them. A lot of dancing. Please enjoy the Mwangaza Children's Choir.
thank you very much for having us today. May God richly bless you. Thank you for listening. This is it. Hope to see you tonight at the concert at 7 p.m. Uber Baptist Church. Tomorrow at the C3 Church at exactly 10 a.m. Or you can find us at St. George's Choir at 1.30. That's in Sorel. So thank you so much for having us. Thank you so much. You've been a lovely, lovely audience. Thank you, thank you. You got anybody in blue? Or we have a couple of other friends of ours from here can give you information about this choir. They have flyers, you can book this choir for maybe your church or your school or something. They have business cards you can get to here from our tour manager. If you want to know more about this choir, if you want to know our website, it's mchoir.org. M-C-H-O-I-R.org. You can get us online. Facebook page, Mwangaza Children's Choir Australasia. You can find out about us more. For any more questions, just talk to anybody in blue, in a blue shirt. Give me one of the kids, can give you information. Or we have some of our friends from here also who are flyers. You can talk to them. Thank you so much. I want to appreciate the administration of these grounds for allowing us to be here. So we appreciate people of Tasmania. We're going to walk around your market and see how it feels like also. So thank you so much. Uh, may God richly bless you as we say. Hello, my name is uh, Pastor Sa. I'm right in front of the Parliament Gardens right here in Tasmania. You've just seen the Mwangaza Children's Choir. Awesome, awesome kids from Uganda. Thank you so much, Australia. Thank you so much, Tasmania, for welcoming us to your great city, for welcoming us right in front of your parliament grounds. The kids love your country. We love your country. It's been fun just sharing the love of God through music. As they've danced, the people have come here in crowds and they've enjoyed the music. They've really enjoyed what the stories of the African children. It's a blessing to be in this country. We know that Australia is a great nation and we believe God that Australia will be greater still. Tasmania will be a great, a great state too. Thank you so much and may God bless you. So Destiny of Africa production. So that's what we're talking about tonight. It's all about Destiny of Africa production. So our man Lopez. So what do you think of Destiny of Africa production? Have you ever heard of Destiny of Africa production? I think it's absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I cannot recommend it more. It's brilliant.